I was always sort of an athlete uh, growing up and, and always wanted to get out of the house and play and compete. I know my dad tells a story about how I would run onto the field when my older brother was playing, and I think I was three or four, and they're telling me I was too young to, to actually be on the team, but I still wanted to play. I still wanted to be in the action. I don't know, I think if, if someone really wanted to get to know me, I think starting from being a child of immigrants is a good starting point. In fourth grade at my new elementary school, I was friends with a few people. All of us were new to the school, had just moved there. We would play sports, and it would literally just be the four or five of us on a team. So we'd play like soccer, and there would be what felt like an army of fourth graders on the other team against like three or four of us, because nobody wanted to play on our team but I felt like I was at home with the people that were new. That felt like my people uh, for some reason. It felt like that's who I was supposed to be with, even though I think I probably could have played both sides of the coin. Our clients are oftentimes in the fight of their lives, and there's nowhere I'd rather be than in that fight with them. I do feel like these are my people. I feel like that there is representing my clients as they take on an enormous challenge, a huge fight, uh, that their life, their family depends on most of the time. That pressure to be able to perform and, and achieve something great for them, that pressure is a privilege. It is.